Good afternoon, my name is Pop. This video tutorial in Ubuntu Basics shows you how you can take a downloaded audio album consisting of all of the songs in one single file and split that album up into individual songs. Quite often on YouTube you can download whole albums, but then you are stuck with playing that whole album in sequence, song one, song two, song three, and of course you'll want to be able to play them individually. I've already done this with two of these things. Here I have made a folder and when I open up the folder you can see that the songs are individual and I can play any one of them I want to without playing any of the others or play them in any order. The ones over here consist of entire albums and the way you do this is pretty easy. First of all right click somewhere where you're not on a, a file and put in a new folder and when you've got a, an untitled new folder you're going to rename it and here I'm going to call it Beatles for Sale and I'll just go Beatles for Sale and now I've got a new brand new blank folder and I'm going to split this up and put it in here. The way you do that is to download a program and you get that from the Ubuntu Software Center and Go to the Ubuntu Software Center and find yourself uh, the term Audio Splitter. And I've got this one right here. There are two, but I, I use the first one that I found and it works pretty darn good. It's called MP3 SPLT-GTK Audio Splitter. And the program works very well and I like it and I recommend it and I have not used all of the features of it. The only thing that I am using it for is to split the songs up with silence and you've got to tell it three parameters to hunt for. One is what you're going to be using and here this is the source file and then the preference in the preferences you're going to tell it where to put everything that would be the output file and the last thing is what kind of split well I told it silence and here when I hit split it does it and I'm not going to put this on pause I'm going to allow you to see how long it takes for an entire album it doesn't take very long at all after it gets to the end here you'll see it go through it again and lay down the tracks of the individual songs and when it does so I will go over to that formerly empty album and you'll be able to see all of the individual songs doesn't take very long at all. I gotta feel impressed by this. And here we go. I'm going to go back to Nautilus and I'm going to open this up. And here is the Beatles for Sale individual songs. And you can select any one of them now and play that one individual song. You do have to rename everything. It has no capability of renaming the songs by their proper name. My name is Pop and I've got a whole bunch of videos on YouTube called Ubuntu Basics and I thank you very much.